Let's install Plants vs. Zombies with Wine Tricks. I've installed Wine Tricks according to the instructions at winetricks.org, so it shows up in my menu, and it has an install a game option. So let's use that, scroll down to Plants vs. Zombies, click Next, now this installer starts kind of slow, so Wine Tricks has to wait for it. It uses Auto Hotkey to wait for things. That's what that H icon is. Dum de dum dum dum. Okay. Once the installer starts, it's pretty quick. All right, we're done with Wine Tricks. The game installs one useful icon and one not so useful icon. Let's delete the not so useful one. You can run the game either with this nice icon or you can use the regular Y in menus. Um, that's kind of nested, so let's just try the desktop one. And start the trial. Let's say my name is Joe. Plants vs. Zombies is a tower defense game, which means you try to put obstacles in the way of the bad guys. In this case, the obstacles are little plants. When you have enough sun, you can put down another plant. Three pea shooters ought to be enough. Yay, we won the level. All right. So let's say that we're done playing. And let's say for the sake of argument, we want to uninstall it. Go to Wine. You can't use this one. That only uninstalls from the default Wine prefix. And Wine Tricks installs each game into its own Wine Prefix. So if we want to do something to the game, we have to select where it got installed to, and then say what we want to do. In this case, we want to blow it away. Right. It's gone. So that is how you install Plants vs. Zombies with Wine Tricks and uninstall it. Pretty easy.